Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day. From the NASA website it is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for December 20th of 2022. Well, it is titled Thor's Helmet. So what do we see here? Well, here we see a nebula with a perhaps a resemblance to the winged helmet of the Norse god Thor, and sometimes called again called Thor's helmet or by the catalog designation of NGC 2359. So what this is, is actually the nebula around a star. So this is not a star forming region, but a star that has already formed and in fact a very young, very hot star known as a Wolf Rayet star. Now the star itself is toward the center of the bubble shaped nebula there where material is being expelled out from the star. And these Wolf Rayet stars are extremely active and are constantly losing material. So material is being spread out into space and they are losing losing mass. However, the star itself is still going through its evolution. It is converting hydrogen into helium at a very rapid rate and will quickly run through that and will eventually then start fusing other elements as it runs out of hydrogen. Now each heavier element that it tries to fuse gives it less and less energy to power the star and eventually the star will become unstable and will likely explode as a supernova. Now when will this occur? Well, we've probably got thousands of years to wait. Remember that most things in astronomy do not happen on time scales of a human lifetime. So we could likely be watching this star for many generations waiting for it to explode. But eventually it will and will become an extremely bright object, even though this is 15,000 light years away. Now, if we think about that, our own sun would be invisible at 15,000 light years away. This star we can see it now. And were it to explode as a supernova, or I should say when it explodes as a supernova, it will become extremely bright, the brightest object in the sky, except perhaps our sun and moon. Many supernovae, if they're nearby enough, can actually be visible during the daytime. They can be bright enough to overwhelm the sky brightness of our sun and be visible during the day. So what will exactly will happen here is something that we're going to have to wait a few thousand years until this star finishes going through its stages of evolution and eventually then explodes as a supernova. So that was our picture of the day for December 20th of 2022. It was titled Thor's Helmet. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Solstice Sun. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.